excuse me as I do hot girl stuff. <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm having a little fun. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today is a good day already. Today I have a fun one for you. So, with lots and lots of fun. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and get into the reading. Oh, speaking of my book, I have a book out there. With the book boyfriend. Point it near you. I did that workout. I love these things. So we are getting out of here. Oh, da -da -da -da. Delicious, delicious, delicious. We're doing an early morning uh, grocery run. Alright, ow! This thing just coming. <laughs> Gotta tell somebody. But you know how that goes. I'm actually switching out of this one. I'm running to my next. Hello, cook buddy. How are you? Lies. Lies. Just finished. <laughs> back. Again, that was Lexi Miles, uh, romance author. Welcome to my channel. Today is a fun one for you guys. I'm gonna go over my winter morning routine. Yes, I just did a fall one, but my winter one is slightly different. Um, what I didn't tell you in my fall one was, um, I was kind of like um, chilling out on my couch. I was like crashing out there and waking up out there. So I woke up in my bed today, so now you're all caught up. Yeah, I don't even know if that was important, but that's one of the things that are different. <laughs> so it is different. Good morning, guys. This is the sexiest. I thought you could see first thing in the morning. Ready to eat. Let's get your food. There we go. It's cold out here, so I gotta turn on the heat. Ugh. So we just moved your bowl back out here. And here we go. Alright, so let's get. What is it doing? Oh, it's getting your food. Let's see. Uh, no, not there. Okay. Oh, hi, face. I'll get it for you right now. She's like. Food, mommy, food. Now, I have the food. And yeah. By the way, in between, we had to make a potty stop, so we did that already. All right, guys, so I just gave her breakfast. Toss it in here, right Usually she has kernels, but I've gotta to go to the store, so there's no kernels happening today. Yeah. This to the chef, she loved it. <laughs> Harley, where'd you go, babe? She's checking it back over to say, hey, is there anything else in there? No, you cleaned it. I hope you noticed this, but um, my dog always, when I ever I cook for her, she gives me kisses like on my feet right after, and she goes, oh, thank you. She's such a polite little bubby. So cute, raising her well. <laughs> All right, oh, there you are, okay. You in the bathroom? Okay, come on, let's go. Oh, he is sleeping right now, so. <laughs> Come on, sweetie, you done? Let's get you out of here. So now that I got that done, I have her taken care of. I gotta take care of me. All right, so once I have her fed, I pop back in here to my room. Ooh, almost fell on my head. That was good. All right, I'm not awake, so it is what it is. Um, so then I actually chill here for a minute. Let me show you. I do some editing and I post my Instagram. Oh, Harley. And she's done. She cleans her little face. Does her morning grooming. Come on, honey. Was your breakfast good? Was it to your liking? Yes. Okay, good. All right, guys. So now I'm gonna knock out a quick workout. So I will show you a couple of the exercises. I'll just clip in a few of the things that I do. <laughs> but I'm not gonna show you because right now I'm really relaxed and I don't want to have to change to show you so you can see whatever. Because right now, um, yeah, I just am doing this really. Um, uh, Sleepy. So here we go. Okay, so here are some of the exercises that I do. I like to do some ball work. I like to do um, some stuff targeting my abs. I like to do some squats, um, some uh, deadlifts, and um, I like to do things to engage my arms. So that's what I'm doing basically like a full body workout. Um, and of course burpees, because burpees kind of get everything as a full body workout as well as a nice circuit to get your heart rate up. So that's what I'm doing. So now I'm running my bath water as you hear. I love to have my bath water absolutely perfect because it's just something that makes my day like extra nice. So if there's something that makes your day like really good, make sure you do it for yourself because that just helps you start your day like perfect. 
Alright guys, so now I am just doing my the washing of my face. So I'm using this. And I'm using this. I don't know if you notice my skin's a lot better than it was on some of the recent ones. Am I the only one who makes like funny noises when you like wash your teeth? Hmm. Anyway, by the way, I just ran out when I was washing it. So I'm gonna get a new one right now, so I'm not like ah, in the morning. <laughs> we stopped. Excuse me as I do hot girl stuff. <laughs> Alright, that was code for I had to um, take care of my underarms. <laughs> uh, now I'm gonna shave my legs and go from there. <laughs> Now I gotta do the upper thigh, but that's gonna be like showing too much, so be back in a minute. For those of you who are curious, I would be. I use, I sometimes I just shave like period, depending upon, but since it's still winter, I like to have a little more um, moisturizer before I shave my legs. Summer, I'll just like free shave them without anything, but I use this. So any kind of Gillette or skin to mint or something like that, I'll use that because it has like a nice hydration to it. And then I use the Venus razor. I love these. These are amazing because they work under your arms, they work on your arms, and yeah. The other thing that I would be curious about and I would, I would wanna know too, I shave my arms. Do I also shave my knuckles? Yes, I do, because that has hair on it. So it gets all the areas. So everything that you wanna shave, you can make sure it's nice and shaped, okay? guys do you have you seen those challenges where if it's a guy product they ask girls about them if it's a girls product they ask um, guys about them to see if they know um I'm surprised that bees are not in there you know what I mean like what the heck is this right and some people will be like oh it's just a travel razor but no this is to make sure that you can get the smaller parts of a female body female anatomy but I was just wondering you know when you shave but I was just wondering um why aren't those in there so anyways, I would be curious. I mean, they're always so funny to hear like the different responses. Okay, just beat myself in the face. Anyways, you guys, um, you get the idea. The thing that I'm curious about, I wonder how shaving started. I took anthropology and I studied anthropology in college and that's just like behavioral and all that stuff. So this always gets me curious. So I'm gonna go check. If it's interesting, I'll share it. If it's not, I'll just be like, eh. Okay, so here we go. Okay, so the story was, um, prior to 1920, uh, the definition of femininity um, was uh, moral character. After 1920, you know, like in the 20s, um, in the United States, so I'm sorry about but anyways, um, after the 1920s, um, it became more of an emphasis on the female figure, the female body. Um, and so, since it was like the fashion or anything, and people were showing a little more skin in the 1920s, started doing hair removal and adapting it from other places. So that is how that came to be. By the way, the reason why that is perceived as sexy is because um, it is um, taking care of your skin. Like it's taking extra care and it's saying that you, um, you know, you practice being you know, extra something or healing softness or lotion or something like that. So that was very interesting. Another fun fact, 80% to 99% of women typically, in the United States again, um, typically shave nowadays or do some form of hair removal so they do not have it. However, it does not say exactly on the arms because I know some people don't shave their arms, but that's just something that I do because I like to shave my arms because I know that it's nice and smooth and a friend of mine taught, discussed this. I've been doing it ever since high school. A friend of mine discussed this and her mom was in like beauty pageants and stuff like that and we got into it and I went, hmm, well, I want to be a little more sexy, a little more pretty. So <laughs> that's why I do it. But everybody else has their like own thing. That is totally up to you. It's 100% your choice what you want to do. I just know that as somebody who does shave and does keep their, you know, like basically no hair on my body pretty much, um, I just find that, um, you know, it just helps 
one, to make sure that you always smell amazing, but also at the same time, um, it gives you an extra layer of, because like I put a little more lotion on and it kind of sinks in better to my skin, so it makes me a little softer, and different things like that, lots of practical reasons. But let me see what they say the benefits are. Importantly, <laughs> do I agree? Oh. All right, so I looked that up. Um, I am gonna go ahead and attach what they said for the benefits from a gynecological point of view and stuff like that, so I'll include the article below so you can see that. However, um, some of the top benefits is that it's, you know, it makes sure that you don't track any sweat in your hair and you sweat less. Um, it also says that it improves sensitivity and so on and so forth. It'll go more into detail below, but um, like I said, I just wanted to go ahead and share that information and it's pretty darn cool. Oh, the other benefit, it was saying like fashion and style wise, if you have fabric that lays right on top of everything, it also gives you a cleaner appearance, like you know, you don't see any like ridges, like you know how you see visible padding line, you won't see any hair lines under there either. So that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, so anyways, enough about this, let's go ahead and go on with my day. As you see in the morning, I also looked things up. That was my thing that I looked up in the morning this time. Anyway, so now after I have finished all of that, um, um, I basically will use my, I use this, it's so nice. And um, basically you tap it on your face. You don't have to remove it, so you just put it on there. Um, uh, you do not rub it hard, you just gently rub it across your skin. Anyway, and then you just let it dry naturally and then you go from there. Okay guys, and after that, just use my Evian. And that is my skincare for the day. I'm gonna jump in my bath now. Guys, and this is my own well, clinic. Mm. This is actually Neutrogena, but anyways. So these are my products that I use. Um, this is like a shower clean the dial soap that I use. And then, yeah, so I just use these things. Um, so I do mix it out with Crest or Colgate. There it is. And anything like with a Cool Men, a Fresh Men, or something like that. There we go. Last minute edition, of course, the Avion. <laughs> right, so before I get into the bath, I light the candle. This one's lasting me like a long time, but anyway, so I will right. and listen to some music, some Zen music, and just enjoy how nice that is. All right, those candles burnt really fast. I mean, the match burnt really fast. So. So, now that I am done with my bath, I'm gonna move to the main room where I'm gonna be working and everything. So I'm gonna take Harley's stuff up front with me now. All right, and done. All right, I'm also <laughs> gonna uh, clip the heat. Anyway, so I'm gonna go. All right guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and make the shakes. Usually Chloe makes them, but if I'm making them, there's gonna be ice and chunks in there for sure. She always makes it so smooth. But since I'm doing this, I'm gonna show you, you know, the morning routine, and I'll actually make them actually today. All right, guys, but first, let me go ahead and take out the dishes for my room. There's our shake um, potatoes are actually in there, and I usually take out the dishes first thing in the morning, but yeah, I didn't do this morning, but now that I'm gonna go get the shakes, I have to do that so that I don't get any dishes like just piling up in the sink. I'm gonna do it in super speed, so here we go. And that is it on this. <laughs> now I'm gonna go ahead and make the shakes. All right, just making the shake. Do a few cubes at the bottom here. Put in a little bit of chocolate powder. Okay, this is a vanilla 
chocolate shake, but I like normal chocolate like this. For Chloe too. I do put in a little milk, but I have it usually mostly just tea. Um, I really like coconut milk. It's really good in here. But we have regular milk because you know we're making other recipes. Liz. Hey! Little face, how are you? You're in the bath, huh? Mm. Chloe's up in the back, so she was her. Uh, okay, so I'm just gonna take this. Okay. Alright, time to blend it. Alright. And there we go. My girlie is not a fan of black noises like anything that's helpful for clients. I've said this plenty of times. So when I start this, she's like, bye. <laughs> All right, let's go right back in the dishwasher. <laughs> the morning, having the shakes really helped me because if not, I'll be like waiting for like forever to eat. So I don't ever have to think, oh, what am I going to eat? I just usually drink my shakes in the morning. There's Chloe's and here's mine. Delicious. <laughs> Are you a bad boy? Are you a bitch? Okay, so now that I have the shake ready and everything else, um, Chloe and I just sit here and, see, I'm a little shaker here. Um, Chloe and I um, look at like social media, play a couple video games in the morning, and then we, yeah, we just talk about a whole bunch of stuff and we just giggle. So there's Chloe over there, here she is. And now we're just hanging out a little bit. Mm. Hey, Chloe. <laughs> Hi. Carly's sitting down there just relaxing. <laughs> Guys, so now Chloe has gone to go take her shower. I'm gonna walk back to my room. I don't know if I'm gonna see a cute little face on the way. Where's my Bubba? There you are. Hi. All right guys, so after I have my chat with Chloe, um, I come back into my room and I literally put my legs up against the wall and take a moment to meditate for about 10 minutes. So I'm gonna go do that right now. Are you gonna take a chill with me? Here we are. Okay, Mama's gonna do her chill. You ready? You wanna chill too? You wanna chill too? Okay, let's do it. So, uh, this is my view. Okay, so I put my legs on the wall here. And I just put it in a frogger stance here. Like a little frog, and I chill like this for 10 minutes. And I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. So as I chill, I've gotta turn you guys off. So I'll be back in a bit. I'm gonna turn off my phone and everything because I just have it quiet when I do this. Where's my dog? Where'd you go? There you are. Hi, Bubba. Hi, sweetie. Hi, sweetheart. All right, guys. So I just finished meditating, which was absolutely amazing. I love it. I love to just. I always feel so zen after. All right. Um. So now. I go into my next thing, which is also one of my very favorite things to do. Here I go. All right, where's my puppy? Where's my puppy? Where's my puppy? There's my puppy, come on. It's playtime. You wanna do puppy playtime? All right, let's do it. Oh, ha, ha. All right, all right. Mm-hmm. I did that, I did that. Oh, where'd you go, you little thing? <laughs> Alright, so Chloe is in the next room with potential treats. So she keeps thinking that Chloe's gonna get her some treats, but Chloe's actually just grabbing some clothes for the day. So it's just really funny because she's like, mm -mm, I'm never seeing her on treats. Bye. Well, guys, it's official. I think she's like coming back right now. Uh, maybe I should just go try over in the other room. Yeah, so here we go. Usually we play in here, we do like playtime. Okay. Let's do it. 
Earlier, when um, we were sitting there, we were just doing our normal morning, watching this stuff and playing games and stuff. She was talking. Do you want to go about the recipe? About the recipe? <laughs> of course, you know, we are like, oh, yes, and we could jump in and do it, but... Um, yeah, I mean, I can do complicated recipes. I can do stuff with the fancy stuff, but at the same time, I'm like, oh, it's so much easier than you think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you do that. Just people who don't are going to be like, what is that? Huh? I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> so. When they're just making a fancy stew. I mean, it was just a fancy stew. Just throw it in the pot. I'll just put it in the Drop and walk away. What are they doing? <laughs> that was one of the things that you are. And she always does like substitutions, like how you can substitute and stuff like that. So you can go over to her channel because she's going to start really showing you that a lot, right? Alright guys, so um, now um, I would jump into work. I will show you that. I am going to jump into a few things as far as work. Um, let's see. I have a few things I like to review. Um, I have like a little sheet that has like the things that I have planned for the day. I write it the night before. Um, first thing that I'm doing actually today, so it's like amazing, but I'm going to be writing. So I'm going to be doing some writing um, after I finish posting a few things over on social media and touching them with my reader group and stuff like that. Okay, now that I've done some work, there's Chloe again. Hey, Chloe. I'm going to go ahead and go because um, I also have to run an errand. Usually I would do work or jump into an errand or whatever, but today it's an errand. So this morning I'm running some errands and that's what's going to happen. And so I'm going to say goodbye. Bye, you guys.